welcome. Today we've got a special video because we're celebrating 100,000 subscribers and I'm going to show you the top five pops that brought us there. The top five pops of 2019 because we've only been going for a year. Big thank you to everybody who supported us, all the people who've watched, all the people who've subscribed around the world, all our patients. So if, remember, if you haven't subscribed, remember to do so. We've also got a lot of clips. Hundreds of people have emailed us with their reaction videos and photos. They've been watching our videos, they've filmed themselves, and so we're gonna be putting our reaction videos into the top five pops. So, if you've seen anything from lipomacist.com and you think you need treatment, then don't hesitate to contact the team at lipomacist.com. So wherever you are in the world, reach out to us and we'll be able to provide you with, uh, with assistance. So, hope you enjoy the videos. Thank you ever so much for subscribing. And let's crack on, let's see the top five pops. You okay? Mm -hmm. We're just beginning to see the surface of the cyst um, right on uh, a very shiny, oily surface. Mm. The next thing up is we're going to just try and make some space for us to remove this. It's in really well. I'm just going to give it a little bit of a squeeze. Mm Kind of went Okay, all right, leave that to work for a few seconds. And what I'm gonna do is just make a small incision at the top uh, and try and get some of this stuff out, okay? Look, it's gonna try and get this stuff out now, okay? Just gently squeeze the sides just to empty the volume out. 
it's quite a lot of volume there. Just take that away. Okay, the next one to do is see if we can get sack out. Or we'll see if there's a sack. It's a little bit more volume still at the base there. Okay, so if we can just grab the sack out from the base, just peel it away. Okay, so that's the inside of the sack. And if we turn it around, we can see the bottom of the sack there in its entirety. So we just move that to the side. Okay, so what I'm going to do first is just draw up the anesthetic yeah. and then clean the skin mm -hmm. and then we'll try and remove this, uh, what appears to be a rather large blackhead. How long has it been there? Oh, years. Years. How many years? I would say three or four years. Three or four years. Okay. Nephrin, it's going to go underneath the skin there. It's very, very tense because this blackhead is really large, mm -hmm. really quite large. So put the anesthetic in, um, it will leak out of every gap that it can. Here's, these are very superficial lesions, often without a sac. Um, commonly, sometimes known as pores of weenus in the United States. Um, uh, okay, so let's pop this in. As we put the anesthetic, the area becomes a little bit blanched. How are you, how are you for pain, sir? Are you okay? Yeah. Was that, was well, any of that painful? No, not particularly. Oh, wonderful. Very stoic. That's what we need for today. Okay, so I'm gonna make a small incision and see if we can excavate this, uh, this rather large black head. Let's open that up like that. As we do that, we can see just what we're dealing with, a rather large blackhead. Look at that, okay. It's hard inside, you can just kind of just tap it. It's all solidified there. So let's see if we can remove this plug uh, and get you sorted. Okay, okay. This might not be the easiest thing. It's very, very dry. Okay, so as we pop the skin, this thing is just coming out solid. They do take several years to build up, especially at this size. Mm. Let's just see if we can. Is it connected to anything? Hmm? Is it connected to anything? No, no, they're just sort of Zebra. dead skin. Um, that hmm. not necessarily connected, but just buried underneath. Yeah. Um, sometimes they do have sacks, um, but in this instance, it doesn't appear to be. So I'm just going to have a little rummage, get all this stuff out underneath. There's just layers of dead skin there. Let's move this to the side. You think it's full of fluid? I think it's full of... Um, Whatever. Yeah. yeah, full of 
content like whatever keratin and sebum and dead skin and every anesthetic is going in and the, and the great thing about anesthetic is it's got a bit of adrenaline yeah. I prodded it too okay and everybody else everyone's prodded it yeah everyone in the Isle of Wight's given it yeah good, everyone's given it a little, little squeeze little. it's like a good luck charm well they say what's that what's that okay and then they go straight for the yeah, face yeah sorry okay yeah so what we'll do is we'll try and get this out just gonna open that up and just get that content out And actually, what, what we've done there is just squeeze the whole epidermoid out as well. Oh, yeah. Sack and all. Is yeah. that? Yeah? Yeah. So that's how we do it at lipomasis.com. Just get the whole thing out all in one go. Yeah? Yeah. That's advantageous, is it? Hmm? That's an advantage, is it? Well, yeah. it is for you because it speeds up the whole process. Does it? Oh. Yeah. I, so, can't, I can't feel a thing. Well, that's brilliant. Right, young man, ready? Yeah. Any pain, let me know. Okay, so just want to get some good access on this uh, on this little friend of yours. Yeah. Let's take a look at what's inside, shall we? Oof, that was a surprise. Big surprise, big, big, big square to that one. Was it a? No, that's a massive sebaceous cyst as we thought. Just literally going everywhere. <laughs> you can see the video after. Yes. Yeah. yes. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's um, let's try and do this without destroying the whole. Operating room. How long have you had this? Since I was like maybe 19. I'm like, I'm now like 36. So I went to the doctor and they just said, couldn't do my phone or Do it as a lipoma. Classic. Let's try and just get this thing out of here. Are they less likely to go back or more likely to? Well, it depends. Yeah. Depends if we can get the whole thing out. Which of course we will. Yeah. You know, it's not like us to do anything other than the best job. <coughs> wow, it's like a massive boiled egg that's uh, coming out of your th your hamstring. 
very creamy, like Milky Bar. Look at that, look at that coming out. Gosh, gosh, it adds so much more. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. Wow. That is really something. Okay, let's pop that over to the side. 